How's it going, everybody? It is September 28th. This is Merch by Amazon or Merch on Demand sales update. I will go through the numbers. I, I don't think I've done this month's uh, sales update at all. I know I've been slacking on the videos, uh, just kind of trying to figure things out. I think I'm, uh, I'm going to get back to more regular videos uh, and uh, just because there's there, there are a couple of other things that I wanted to talk about, and I know that the sales updates are almost also fun for a lot of people, so I'll do that. But uh, let's get into these numbers. So, at the beginning of the month, I I really really thought this was going to be one of the worst uh, months. There were a couple of things where uh, my my sales going into the month uh, were pretty good. And then for the first, I would say maybe a week or two, it, it was just, I don't, I don't know what was happening. Um, it could have been just me. It could have been uh, something behind the scenes. But there were there were a few days where I had, you know, just, I think, a few ones. I, uh, I can't remember, like, but it was pretty rough. So anyways, but but now, nearing the end of the month, it's, it's funny because it's like I'm almost going to... Uh, you know, get to to match the previous month. I've already beat it in royalties, which is awesome. And uh, and then we'll look at the overall number. So right now I'm sitting on 154 in the US, as you can see here, 3039 in sales for the total royalties of 532. Now what saved me is where I said that uh, I've, I've already beat the previous month in royalties because royalties per sale are, are much higher than the last month's. I think last month was like 299 ended up being in, in the end. Here we're looking at 345. So this just shows you how important pricing your I items is, especially like when it comes to royalties, because a lot of people I've noticed when it comes to print on demand and, uh, and specifically uh, merch, the, the whole theory, especially at the beginning is like, price your items super super low because people think that that's gonna you know uh it's gonna get traction and then if you if you get a smaller uh bsr you know it's just gonna take off and you're gonna start selling but but later on i think people realize like what are you in in this for and it's it's for uh money you want to make money this is a business right so so you know i would much rather get five dollars Per sale than than you know two ninety nine, uh, and and I've actually learned over the years that it does it, it really does come down to uh, the quality of the design, and uh, and also the the keywords and and titles and all that kind of stuff. So right now I'm actually feeling really good about the month uh, because uh, with with this with one fifty four here and the rest of the uh, marketplaces, I'm looking at 244. So this is actually really good because if we add this up, we're looking at uh, 630, 650, 750-ish at this point, so so in royalties. So that's actually not so bad. As you can see here, uh, the, the UK is a little surprising because it is higher uh, than I anticipated and Japan's still doing okay. All the other marketplace Germany is okay, but all the other marketplaces are are actually just uh, you know kind of just chugging along. Uh, Italy is actually surprising me with eleven, uh, but but overall uh, you know it, it feels good. Let's see where I was uh, the previous month. So right now two forty four, two sixty nine. So I might even you know with the with the next uh, couple of days I'm recording this on the twenty eighth. Uh, the next couple of days I actually might beat. Uh, the previous month but I, I think I actually beat it uh, in royalties so so yeah other than that I'm still uh, stuck in uh, tier 20,000 I've, I've maxed it out uh, and then they'll remove the designs I guess due to no sales uh, or, or maybe rejections or something like that uh, so I'm, I'm sitting at almost 20,000 uh, other than that I, I really wanted to kind of take some time and, and filter, basically go through my designs and get rid of, you know, potentially thousands of designs. I still might do that. The reason I've left it right now is because I don't feel that pressure to, to really work every single day on merch. Uh, so this has given me time to actually start concentrating on, on Walmart. There's other things that I'm doing for YouTube. So, so it, it's really, really freed up the time. But uh, there's a, there's definitely a level of guilt uh, now that I feel uh, because I'm not doing my 
you know, merch routine every single day. Like I'll go, I'll go for weeks now uh, without even designing anything which is kind of strange because that that used to be my daily thing because for for Walmart and other uh, marketplaces I'm I'm still using the designs that I have that I've developed for merch but but merch is the original kind of platform where everything kind of stems from so anyways I think this is kind of the, like it's a nice tri- I would say transitional uh phase for me because I might come back and say you know what uh, it, it was a waste of time. Merch is it. Merch is, is you know, because the workflow, the, the way that I've designed it is is everything stems from here. So all the designs that, that I make for uh, merch, it, they, it goes to Etsy, it goes to Shopify, it goes to eBay. Now we got Walmart, a couple of other smaller uh, sites that I've kind of just like ignored, like Redbubble and Society6 and things like that. Uh, but uh, but yeah, we'll see what's gonna happen. I I really wish I I I was in a higher tier where I could just keep pumping out designs. Uh, but I'm glad that that there hasn't been a significant uh, drop in sales because a lot of people are just basically convinced that if you stop doing kind of stop doing anything with uh, merch, that's what's gonna happen with your uh, with your sales as well. But no, it hasn't happened. I've I've only received like the the expected dip, uh, which which you know kind of happens around this time of the year. Uh, so so anyways, I just kind of like trucking along. So pretty good. Uh, so far, I'm happy with the royalties with the sales. Uh, I'll do more updates, uh, maybe on different topics and stuff like that. But but for now, this is it, and I'm feeling pretty good. So thank you guys. I'll talk to you soon.